Safeguarding Philippine Waters Exploring suitable ships for the Coast Guard, the vast Philippine archipelago demands a robust Coast Guard equipped with diverse vessels to uphold maritime security and law enforcement. Choosing the right ships becomes crucial considering factors like budget, terrain, and evolving threats. Let's explore some types of ships well-suited for the Philippine Coast Guard's diverse missions. 1. Offshore Patrol Vessels OPVs. Role, long-range patrols, fisheries protection, search and rescue, SAR, and humanitarian assistance. Advantages, endurance, versatility, ability to carry helicopters and drones for extended coverage. Examples, BRP Gabriela Salang, BRP Melchior or Donez Jr. considerations. Acquisition and maintenance costs, crew requirements. 2. Fast attack craft, facts. Role, interdicting illegal activities, protecting territorial waters, rapid response within archipelago. Goes. Advantages, speed, maneuverability, suitability for shallow waters, and close quarters operations. Examples, BRP Gabriella, BRP Bagake considerations, limited range and endurance, crew size, 3. Multi-mission vessels, MMVs. Role, versatile platform for patrol, law enforcement, SAR, and environmental protection. Advantages, adaptability, ability to carry specialized equipment for various missions. Examples, BRP Kalahi Class 2005's considerations. Initial acquisition cost, potential for further modular upgrades. 4. Special Mission Vessels, SMVs. Role, specific tasks like diving operations, pollution control, and maritime law enforcement. Advantages, tailored capabilities for specialized missions, enhancing effectiveness. Examples, BRP Melchior Chico, Hydrographic Survey. BRP Malapasqua, Marine Mammal Research Considerations. Specialized design and equipment leading to higher acquisition and maintenance costs. 5. Unmanned Surface Vehicles, USVs. Role, cost-effective surveillance, intelligence gathering, and patrol in high-risk areas. Advantages, reduced risk to personnel, extended endurance, data collection capabilities. Examples, none currently, but under consideration by the PCG. Considerations, technological development, regulatory framework, integration with manned vessels. Beyond ship selection, choosing the right vessels is just one piece of the puzzle. Effective maritime security also requires crew training and professionalism. Skilled personnel are crucial for operating ships safely and effectively. Logistics and maintenance infrastructure. Ensuring timely repairs and spare parts availability is vital. Regional and international cooperation. Collaboration with other countries strengthens maritime security efforts. Conclusion. Selecting suitable ships for the Philippine Coast Guard demands a nuanced approach. Analyzing mission needs, budgetary constraints and evolving threats is key. By strategically acquiring diverse vessels, investing in personnel training, and fostering regional cooperation, the Philippines can ensure safer and more secure waters for its people and resources.